the the absolutely insane drama surrounding the entire Don Lemon situation continues to get more and more insane by the day as the backlash continues to grow, CNN continues to panic, and now they're promising all these wild things when it comes to Don Lemon and his future on CNN. So now they're saying that he is going to undertake formal training in order for him to learn how to not offend women. This is so funny, and all of this stems from Don Lemon being part of an organization like CNN where he caters to the woke mob and then as soon as he does one little thing that the wokesters don't like he says one little thing that they don't like even if it's true or not they are after him they are trying to completely destroy him and if the, the backlash that he is facing is out of this world so let's get into this whole story here and see what the newest developments are with this whole don lemon situation so don lemon will return to cnn but only after formal training on how to not offend women <laughs> Oh my goodness. And it's funny because they continue to change the story about why Don Lemon isn't there. At first it was, oh, he's just going to take the day off. And then it turned into, oh, he's on vacation. And then it turned to, oh, well, we can't let Don Lemon be on the air because all of you mean conservatives and all of you people are just being super duper mean to him. And now it's turned into this, where now Don Lemon won't be returning at all until he has formal training on this how not to offend women. It's so funny. And it gets even more and more hilarious. So this, it all stemmed from this clip here where Don Lemon basically gave an opinion on something. And you know, this is what he said. This all the talk about age makes me uncomfortable. I think that, I think it's the wrong road to go down. She says people, you know, politicians or something are not in their prime. Nikki Haley isn't in her prime. Sorry. When a woman is considered to be in her prime in her twenties and thirties and maybe forties. What do you that's talk about? Wait. I, that's not according to me. Prime and that is all he said. That is all it took for everyone to lose their minds over this and throw <laughs> Don Lemon on the chopping block. So, reports at CNN having ongoing conversations about Don Lemon's future. So CNN CEO Chris Lick said in a uh, said in a memo uh, Monday night that Don Lemon would return to air Wednesday and undergo formal training after bipartisan backlash over comments he made about women. I sat down with Don and had a frank and meaningful conversation, <laughs> Lick reportedly wrote to his employees. It is important to me that CNN balances accountability with fostering a culture in which people can own, learn, and grow from their mistakes. <laughs> oh my gosh, this this is one of the most entertaining things that is happening right now. This whole Don Lemon situation and it's just funny because this is what happens. This Don Lemon has is is right now reaping what he has sown, okay? He has been someone who has put a lot of energy into pushing the woke agenda. He is someone who has continued to bend over for the woke agenda time and time again. And now he is reaping the benefits of that because of one little thing that he said. So, um, yeah, with all that being said, you know, I just want to give you all a huge thank you. Thank you so much for 300,000 subscribers. That is absolutely just mind blowing. Okay. And it's all because of you guys. You guys are the ones who make this channel possible, who make what I do possible, whether it's here at Josiah Rises or at Epicverse or whatever else. And uh, it's just incredible. So with all of that being said, thank you so much, everyone. Let me know what you think about all this in the comments below, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.